We are here in Durango, Colorado this morning, We're going to take the Cascade Canyon Express steam excursion. It's a 5.25 hour train ride. We're here early and as you can see, it's pretty popular. It's gonna be a good time. So 5.03, that's our car right over there. Durango and Silverton Narrow Gauge Railroad was originally built in 1881 to 1882 as part of the Denver and Rio Grande Railway's effort to reach the rich mines of the San Juan Mountains. For decades, the line hauled ore from Silverton down to Durango, but after World War II, its business shifted to tourism. In July 1881, the Denver and Rio Grande reached Durango and almost immediately started building the final 45 mile stretch up the Animas River to Silverton. The first 18 miles to Rockwood were relatively easy. After Rockwood, however, the route left the wide valley and entered the steep, narrow Animas Canyon, making construction more difficult. It was also more expensive, with costs reportedly reaching tens of thousands of dollars per mile. In some places, the crew had to blast the canyon walls to create a narrow rock shelf for the tracks. With 500 mostly Chinese and Irish workers rushing to complete the line, the grading operations reached Silverton in late spring 1882. A variety of natural disasters and human events have conspired to close the rail line from Durango to Silverton, but so far none have succeeded. The route's remote location and rugged terrain make it susceptible to floods, avalanches, and rock slides.
nice view of the outside of the train. Lunch is about over. It's time to head up front for some photo ops. Looks like everyone has the same idea. That's about a wrap on the Silverton to, to Durango train on the uh, narrow rails. Hope you enjoyed it.